So in this uh, video, I want to show you how I built my incubator with automatic egg turner for chicken eggs. So sa mga gustong uh, gumawa ng sariling uh, homemade incubator, so gusto kong ischare sa inyo kung paano ko ginawa ang incubator na ito na may automatic egg turner. So for the materials, uh, we need a synchronous motor a uh, 220 volts uh, synchronous motor uh, serves as our egg turner. We need also a timer. Uh, I set natin to ng uh, 7, 7 a.m. Then uh, 2 p.m. and uh, 9 p.m. Uh, yung mga itlog ay mahalo ng uh, at least 3 times a day. We have to set it at 7 a.m., 2 p.m. and uh, 9 p.m. Uh, plug. No? Electric or electrical wire. And then, kailangan din natin ng ito uh, I publicated this. No? Uh, itong egg tray natin, no? <coughs> kailangan natin to, uh, ito yung para maghalo dun sa, sa, mga, sa, sa mga itlog, no? So, actually, itong egg tray na ito ay ginawa ko lang, wala pa akong uh, hand reel. Magiging uh, function niya. This place too low, the tendency of the egg will, uh, will jump, no? over here. If this is too high, kung masyadong mataas naman, no, may tendency naman na as ano, no? It can also be used for duck eggs because I, I made it a little uh, wider, no? But kung para sa chicken, it, if it is for, for chicken uh, eggs only, uh, pwedeng mas maliit, no? Okay. Uh, in my uh, previous uh, video, I have shown you how to make a homemade incubator. Now we have to drill a hole on the synchronous motor. Also in my uh, previous uh, video, I have shown the electrical wiring connection step by step and how I built this incubator. Putol ng kahoy para sa support natin. Pubutasan natin to. Ito. So doon sa una kong video, pinakita ko yung step-by-step uh, -step electrical wiring connection nito at paano ko ito binuo. Now let's connect it to the uh, synchronous motor and then ito yung isasaksak sa uh, 220 volts. So, ito na yun. So, nag-publicate lang ako ng uh, uh, parang holder niya. No? So, kahoy lang siya. Ayan. Ayan. Ito, dito natin sasaksak yung, uh, isasaksak natin ito dito sa timer. Okay? Ayan. Dito sa timer. So, so mabubuhay lang siya uh, ng alas 7 ng umaga, ng, 2, ng alas 2 or 2 p.m. at and sa alas 9 ng gabi. Okay? Na isinet natin. So, angle bar lang yan. Pwedeng gumamit kayo ng kahoy. Since may available akong ganito, kaya ito yung ginamit ko. But kung anong available sa nyo, So, I drilled uh, holes also for this. So, nabutasan na natin. So, dito natin ipapasok to Ito yung motor sa ibabaw. Yan. 
ito. Nang magtama siya doon. Lulusot dito. Okay. So, yun. Yan. Tapos, saka natin susuot itong tumilyo. Okay, so ilagay na natin yung uh, tubig. Egg tray. Screen na mas maliit. This is a plastic uh, screen. And then, and ito yung ating... Um, Egg tray, no? Yan. Ito siya. So, ilalagay na natin. Then, ito. Uh, dito siya nakasot. Then, screw natin siya. The incubator now is ready. So, itong incubator na to, no? Uh, kahit walang uh, motor, no? Pwede siyang maging uh, semi-automatic, no? So, kahit hindi na, pwede natin hindi buksan yan, gagamit lang tayo ng stick, no? And then, Ipupush lang natin to, itutulak lang natin yung tray para mahalo yung itlog. Then pwede rin dun sa kabila, na? Pwede rin nating tulak, no? So this incubator can also uh, be used as semi automatic even without uh, the synchronous motor inside, no? And even without opening the lid or the cover of the incubator by using a stick no just we're going to push it the tray inside no just like this so pushing So, you can now rotate the eggs no? without, even without the motor and without opening the lid. Then, you can do it also on the other side. No? You can also push it on the other side. Gently, but gently. Okay. So, this is now semi-automatic. But if you want it to be an automatic uh, incubator with automatic egg turner no so we can use the uh, synchronous motor which i've shown uh, in this uh, video okay the incubation period is 21 days and for the first 18 days the temperature is maintained to an average of 37.5 degrees Celsius and the humidity is maintained between 55 to 65%. Okay, so that is our humidity. And for the last three days, which is day 19, day 20, and day 21, the temperature is maintained at an average of 37.2 degrees Celsius and the humidity is increased from 70% to 85% para lumambot ang shell ng itlog para madaling makalabas ang mga sisiw.
tatlong beses isang araw, kailangan na marotate or mahalo ang itlog para hindi dumikit yung similya doon sa itlog. Pero sa unang araw o yung first 24 hours, hindi kailangan na mahalo ang mga itlog. At ganun din sa huling tatlong araw. Dahil may 21 days tayong incubation period. Three times a day, eggs should be turned by the incubator to prevent the embryo from sticking to one side of the eggs. But for the first 24 hours, egg should not be turned by the incubator. And also, for the last three days, which is day 19, day 20, and day 21. Okay, so in my next uh, video, I will show you uh, how to set or the settings and functions of these uh, 12 volts W1209 uh, digital uh, thermostat for uh, chicken incubator. So, um, if you want to see all my videos, so please uh, click the subscribe button below and, the not and uh, hit the notification bell for you to get notified for my upcoming videos. So again, this is Henry Noche. Uh, thank you for watching and see you in the next videos.